guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so, so, so excited to sit down and film this video. It has been a literally months, an actual eternity, since I have sat down and filmed a home decor haul. So that's what we are doing today. I know I've put out seasonal videos in the meantime, but this one is just straight, regular home decor haul, kitchen, artwork, decor, I don't even know what else, like literally so many things. So anyway, we have a lot of stuff to get into today and it's been so long since I've actually sat down, talked to you guys. I know I've done again my holiday videos but this one is like my first official like actual decor video for 2018 so I'm so excited I cannot wait to get into this I've got so many things I can't wait to share with you guys either so anyway I'm looking around making sure I've like covered all my bases I think that's everything to begin this video so without further ado let's get into my first official home decor haul for 2018 so I know that I usually start my home decor hauls with like my kitchen stuff and whatnot but you know new year new me we're gonna start off with artwork and this first piece I'm really excited for I found this at Marshall's it was only $7.99 and I picked this up originally for my office but the pink is like a tinge to blue for the room so I think that I'm going to put this in my bathroom just because the colors are very very similar but anyway this is just what it looks like it's so cute it's just one of these really fun little canvas art pieces again it is pink and it says but first makeup and there's some really fun makeup brushes that are all black white with gold metallic foil details so I just thought that was a really really fun this is going to look perfect in my bathroom again I know I bought it for the office but it's gonna look really really cute in my bathroom as well so um, I'm really excited I do have an Oliver Gal piece in my bathroom I don't think I've ever actually showed you guys my bathroom anyway nonetheless <laughs> I think this would be really cute in there anyway um, with the other piece of artwork we'll definitely see but yeah again super cheap it was only $7.99 again from Marshalls so these next few pieces one of them is mine and then two of them are my sisters but this first one is mine it's from TG Maxx it was only $5.99 it's just this really awesome print that you can frame and then kind of like a black glittery lettering it says hashtag unicorn I just thought this was so fun I'm going to put this in my office I'm going to kind of rearrange a couple things and figure out how to fit this in there but it's from the brand Marmont Hill oops <laughs> Marmont Hill I have purchased another piece of theirs before but I was just so excited to find uh, like frameable prints inside TJ Maxx sorry for the reflection um and this is actually a good size I don't know if it says no it doesn't say anywhere on here what the actual size is but I was really excited to find these they had a bunch again this was like the only one that I really thought I needed and I just love it so cute and I thought the term like hashtag unicorn was fine because like of course unicorns are really really cute but also unicorns are different they're like magical they're different they're creative they are they stand out. They're just different. So I just love that saying just because I'm always trying to preach like, yes, do what you want. Buy what you want. Don't go by the catalogs. Do whatever you want with your decor. Be different. It's okay. Color is a good thing. Um, so yeah, I just thought that was really, really fun. I liked the simplicity of it, of course, just because I think it's really bold and definitely makes a statement. But I also love the saying as well because I think the statement also makes a statement. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that made sense. Anyway, okay, so I picked up that one for myself. Then these next two are my sisters. And again, they're from TJ max and they're both $3.99 so that's also a really good deal again also from Marmont Hill so this first one is all white with rose gold lettering and it says Paris is always a good idea and it's kind of like a perfect square shape whereas mine was more of a rectangle so that's what the first one looks like and as you can see it is like a foiled lettering and then this one is just a map of Paris and if you guys didn't know her room is all Paris so um yes that is just what that one looks like I thought that was pretty cool and there's kind of like a little um key or map thing down here so it says what all of these numbers stand for what cities all of these numbers are so I thought that was really cool and her plan with these was to frame them and then kind of stack them like this on her wall somewhere you know like hanging on the wall of course so these are great you could also frame these and set these on top of a dresser or like a buffet kind of a table or something like that they would just be really fun just because they are so simple super affordable literally four dollars and six dollars <laughs> that's actually a really good deal so again there's so many different options with these bathrooms bedrooms offices things like that um you name it so many so many options okay so those are our frame or not framed or like pre-framed um prints that's what they're called art prints okay moving right along so this next item i was so excited to come across i found this at hobby lobby it was 60 percent off and the original price of this was 15.99 so i made it about six or seven dollars after the discount which is like an amazing deal i can't wait to use this one day in a bathroom this is so perfect and so me i'm just i'm not saying i am perfect but i'm just saying this is so my taste <laughs> anyway it's this really fun awesome wooden piece of art it just says mermaid hair don't care in that beautiful baby pastel pink color and that baby pastel like tiffany blue color i thought this was so fun they're like little bubbles on this 
Oh, I just think this is going to look so cute in a bathroom one day with all of my pink and Tiffany blue decor. This was just literally perfect. Again, I'm so excited for six or seven dollars. It's such a good deal. Um, and I know that they had other different mermaid like wooden art pieces and things like that. Um, again, comparable pricing and everything, but I was so excited to find this. This was such a fun find. I love the saying, love the colors, love the price, love everything about this. Oh, this is so fun. I honestly cannot wait to decorate with this one one day. Okay, I've got like one more piece of artwork or so kind of along the lines, and then we'll move on to like the rest of my decor. So this next item will look a little familiar because I've had this on my social media, like Instagram, Twitter, and things like that in pictures. So I've had this for a little while, but I know that they still carry them. So basically, again, this one is also from Hobby Lobby, and I got it when I was 50% off. So that was actually really great because the original price of this is $29.99. So I paid $15 for this. Again, I love it. I really want like an all white one, but let me just show you what I have right now. <laughs> so I picked up the really fun pink felt letter board. These are so fun. They kind of have like that vintage -y school touch to them that I just really think is awesome. Um, and again, it's a really, really fun shade of pink. It's not a perfect shade of pink, as you can see, just like a little color contrast. It's a little more blue than a lot of my stuff. It's like a funky little hair on that thing. Anyway, so I think it'd be really, really fun to get a white one because I know that Joann's also has like different colored letters and things like that. So um, before I jump into that stuff, because I do have something anyway. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is just what it looks like. And it also comes with white letters. So I have used some off of here and things like that for pictures and um, everything like that. But it does come with a bunch of white regular lettering, which is really awesome as well. Anyway, I picked up some separate letters at Joann's because I really, really liked these. This is just the set of gold metallic letter board letters. And this is from the brand Home by DCWV. Um, and they're one inch tall. So they're really cool. Again, they're shiny, kind of like a shiny gold color. But I will say this, here's like one shade of gold, which is like the perfect shade of gold. And then there's like this really yellowed can you guys see the difference how this one's like really, really yellow? This one's more of like a normal shade of gold. This one is very, very flashy. <laughs> I know that this company has different colored letters and things like that, um, different variations, different sizes, some are really, really big letters, but I really liked the gold. I didn't know the difference that there was like two different shades of gold in the box. So um, if you're going to be buying the gold, definitely take a little look-see inside the packaging and see if you can't find one that has like all the same matching uh, gold shade, I guess. So anyway, yeah, again, I don't remember the price of these because it's been quite a while, but I do know that I either got them on sale or I bought them with a coupon because I never would have paid full price for those things. So my last little letter board type item, I know Lauren, you're touching your hair, goodness gracious. Um, this is a very mangled up packaging, but I, again, I wanted to keep this to show you what the actual packaging looks like. Uh, this is also from that brand Home by DCWV or DWCV, something like that. And they just call these letter board icons. So on the back, there are a bunch, but I'm going to show you what they look like up close because they're really cute. And I don't think that the picture would do it any justice. This is like the coffee and wine set. So there's this really cute little coffee mug with a cute pink heart. And then there's this cute coffee mug that says yum with kind of a like pinky peach little whipped cream at the top. So cute. And then this one is kind of like a frappuccino cold beverage, which was adorable. And then there were these really cute pink like little heart thing and the gold with white polka dot heart. And of course these all just stick into your letter board. They just have like little pegs on the back. So those were the only ones that I actually wanted out of that set. And then the other three that came in it with the coffee ones were also these wine ones. So there's like two little wine glasses and this a bottle of wine. I don't drink, you guys know that, so I don't really need these. So if you guys are interested and you have a letter board and you want these, I'll mail these to you. All you have to do is basically just tell me in your comment that you're interested in these. Please, um, this will be just like limited to US residents only just because it is such a small little package. And then I don't know, I'll send you a message on here. Make sure you have messaging enabled on your YouTube account because that has been a huge issue with giveaways and things like that. And this one's super small anyway. So if you want these three little items for your letter board, let me know. I will mail them to you because I don't need them. And what's the point of just sitting around my house when somebody can use them and enjoy them? So woo, that was a mouthful. <laughs> okay, I think that is all I have for artwork and letter board talk. Um, we're going to be moving into some more decor. Maybe we'll move into kitchen next. We'll see. Yeah, I think we'll move into kitchen next. So this next set of kitchen towels, I'm so excited for and I cannot wait to use one day. But basically these are from the brand Cassaba. I have so many Cassaba hand towels and I found these at TJ Maxx for only $7.99. Again, a set of two kitchen towels. Love these so much. But again, they're that really fun light baby pink color and then a gold metallic lettering. Look at how beautiful that looks on camera. It just says this kitchen is for dancing. I love that because when I was on the dance team in college, the only spot for me to 
to practice like my turns and things like that was the kitchen because the rest of our house is carpet so that was like the only like slick floor that I could actually slide around on and do turns and whatnot so anyway this just really made me laugh and I thought this was absolutely hilarious and so adorable my colors I just fell in love with this so I thought that was really funny this kitchen is for dancing because that's exactly what I would do in our kitchen when I was in college and I would practice all my moves and my routines and things like that in the kitchen because it is pretty big and we have like a big open area of like tile and stuff like that so anyway this just made me laugh I had to pick these up they were only $7.99 again from TJ Maxx and they are just 18 by 28 inches I thought they were so fun so cute so cassava you guys honestly are constantly killing it with your like hand towel game they always have such cute designs and I could not get up get enough of this one I'm just so obsessed so anyway yeah again just a set of two. Oh, the lettering is on both sides that's actually really, really cool. So um, I know that they're probably going to be coming out with a bunch of new designs and things like that for Valentine's Day, just because um, Valentine's Day is right around the corner. So um, yes, okay, I think that's all I have to say about these hand towels, even though I'm so gosh darn obsessed with these, I just don't wanna stop looking at them. So, okay, uh, that's enough, let's keep going. <laughs> this next item, I was really excited to find this. I have a set of three very similar to this, except they say sugar, coffee, and tea, or flour, coffee, and tea. No, I think it's sugar, coffee, and tea. Anyway, I found another one from Home Goods, and this is from the brand, the master class bake shop and they just call this a storage canister it was only $3.99 which is such an amazing deal but this is just what it looks like it's those really fun pink glass kind of ceramic little containers or canisters whatever you want to call them they're all pink and again I do have the uh, other three that match that kind of like are all in different sizes but this one's really fun in like that fun kind of gold metallic uh, lettering it says sugar and spice so I thought this would be perfect to put cinnamon and sugar in and kind of mix it together keep it near the toaster that way I could have cinnamon sugar toast whenever I wanted to and it'd be this really cute little canister I know it's not like a necessity or anything like that but I thought it was cute it does match the other three that I have and I just loved the little saying on it as well so anyway yeah I know again I'm not overly fond of the wood lid I don't hate it um and I don't really think I want to paint it because I just don't know food safe wise if it's even worth messing with um and worth possibly ruining them if I mess up but anyway yeah again love it it was only $3.99 not a big deal again from home goods so this next item, I did post this on my Instagram and Twitter and whatnot, but I just love this so much. And I've had this for a little while, but I know that they still have these, or at least my store still had them the other day. Um, and this was originally $12. And again, it's just one of those glass kind of warm beverage travel mugs. But this is just what it looks like. It is so cute. It's all baby pink with these really cute little swans all over it. And then all of the swans have little gold metallic crowns. So cute, so adorable. And then in gold metallic lettering, it just says caffeine queen. And this is a lot brighter of a shade of pink than the actual cup itself, but I do have one of my Target mugs that broke that I'm absolutely heartbroken over, but that pink like little silicone lid actually fits this one perfectly. I should have brought it in here. Um, but yeah, FYI, the uh, Target Dollar Spot silicone lids will fit on this if you don't want this hot pink color on it. But again, I still thought it was cute. I love this, love the swans, love the crowns, love the color, love the saying, love everything about it. That's why I buy everything that I buy because I do, do truly genuinely love it. So anyway, but yeah, I've had that for a little while, but you can find it at Charming Charlie. They do still have them. Again, at least my store. You can't hold me accountable for all of your stores, but um, I was just in there the other day. So, okay. Let's keep going. So this next item, I was so excited to find again because one day I was at Marshall's, I saw this, it was broken. My heart was broken because it was broken. And then I was at TJ Maxx. I found something very similar and we'll talk about that later on in the video. That same day after TJ Maxx, I went to Home Goods and I found it and I was so excited, so elated. Basically, this is only $4.99. This is just what it looks like. It's the most cutest unicorn mug that I have ever seen. This is so fun. I know with unicorn stuff, they do so many different color variations, things like that. So again, I'm very picky with my stuff just because I kind of like to keep it all within the same color scheme with like my pinks and pastels and whatnot. And this was absolutely perfect. There's just one little streak of purple, like little hair streak dye thing in the main. I just thought it was really cute. I think it's gonna look really, really cute with all of my other decor and whatnot, but it just has the sweetest face with the really cute little eyelashes, the pink cheeks, the little smile, and then of course the gold metallic horn right up here. I just thought it was so adorable. So I cannot pass this up. There are like little feet on this as well. It was only $5, $4.99, such a good deal. They had a bunch of these at my home goods. So yes, love this. Okay, $4.99. And again, you'll see something a little similar to this a little later on in this video. 
you. So this next item, I just found this at Hobby Lobby the other day. The original price is $9.99 and I don't know if it was already on 40% off clearance or if this is what I used my 40% off coupon for. Again, not quite sure, but this is just what it looks like. I'm going to take this out of the plastic packaging because it's kind of annoying, kind of loud and noisy. But basically this is the most adorable set of salt and pepper shakers I have ever seen. Look at how perfect this is. So it's just the Eiffel Tower on top of this really cute hat box. I thought this was so perfect. The colors are perfect. I know it's completely throwing off everything else in this video, but everything about this was perfect, perfect, perfect. I know I've said that a billion times, but this was so gosh darn adorable. It's going to match my kitchen stuff so perfectly. Basically, this is just one of them. As you can see, the little dots right here, little holes right there. And the Eiffel Tower is all white with gold detailing. And then right here in kind of like the areas that you would see through of the um, Eiffel Tower, it is just a really fun light baby pink color. So here is just what the little hat box looks like. Really fun. Love the Tiffany blue and white striped detailing all the way around it. And then of course the cute like little lid and handle are a really fun shade of baby pink. And the fact that they stack together is even cuter. So I got this for like a little over $5, right? Because yeah, half off would be $5. So I think I paid like six-ish. 650 ish for this. So anyway, I thought this was just so gosh darn adorable. I love this. I don't know if they have this out for like Valentine's Day and things like that, just like part of like the love line, but it does have a spring little sticker on the bottom of the actual packaging that it comes in. So it's not in the decor that's like in the middle of the store. It's off to the side, kind of where like all of the holiday and seasonal stuff is. Anyway, yes, so excited to find this. So, so, so cute. Okay. Moving right along, two more kitchen things, then we'll move on to the rest of my decor. So this next item, I found this at Home Goods. It was only $9.99, and I just thought this would be really fun to have. It's so adorable, and I'm so obsessed with this. It's from the brand called Masterclass Premium Bakeware. This is just what it looks like. Basically, it's just a 12 little muffin cake tin tin pan thing <laughs> for muffins and cupcakes. I thought this was great. It says that it's nonstick commercial weight, also fridge, freezer, and dishwasher safe. Um, and yeah, that's basically all it says. The rest is all in like French or something like that. So I thought this was really, really cute. I love this color, of course. It was so perfect. Um, and I only picked up one, but this was only 10 bucks. I thought that was actually a really good deal for a pan of this size and color. So yeah, not much more to say about this. Really cute. I'm obsessed. I would love to find more like other baking things in this shade of pink. I just thought it was so pretty and it's gonna match the rest of my stuff really, really well. So yes, again, home goods only $9.99. So this next item is my last and final kitchen item for this video, but I've had this one for a couple months. I actually think I posted about this on my Snapchat because it was such an amazing deal. But basically one of my subscribers, she goes by Mello on Instagram. She sent me a like DM, a personal message on Instagram. And she said, girl, you need this. It's on sale at Target. And I was like, oh my God, I literally have to hunt that down. So that's exactly what I did. I found out of like all my targets that are in the Sacramento area, literally all over like Northern California. I was ready to drive like lengths for this thing. But basically we found this at one of mine that's kind of like 30 to 45 minutes away. So it really wasn't that bad. But this was originally like $50. It was half off for literally $24.99. So that's all I paid for this. $24.99. Yes, $25. That's such an amazing deal. This is called, well, first off, it's from the brand Threshold and it's called a Dutch oven with lid cast iron. And this is in the six quart size. So this is what it looks like. She literally hit this on the head. This is so perfect. So me. So as you guys know, I do have all of my pink pans and whatnot, but I've been struggling to find cute pink pots that would match or just anything like within my color scheme and things like that. So when she said this to me, I was like, yes, I have to have this. This was so perfect. Again, it's not really like an actual like pot. This is just a Dutch oven with a lid, but it's so well made, so heavy, so just like perfect. It's not in this box because this would be absolutely breaking my back right now. Okay, so this is just what it looks like. This is the heaviest thing ever. Again, I'm like so scared to drop this. I don't even know, can this shatter? Can ca I guess cast iron can shatter. This is so heavy, but it's the most beautiful shade of baby pink. I think the lighting is really throwing it off right now. I'm, I'm struggling <laughs> to hold it up as well. So I'm probably going to insert a picture, but this is so big and so beautiful. I'm so obsessed with this. And again, I have had it for a couple of months, but that's why I decided to post it on my Snapchat. This is like a perfect dupe for like the Le Crusette line of pots and things like that. This looks just like that. This thing is a beast, you guys. When I'm telling you how heavy this is, Oh, I have to like do this in breaks because it's so big, so heavy. That's why I did not want to put it back in that box and then get it back out. I was like, I'm just going to leave it out since I have to put it in my video anyway. But here is just what the inside looks like. It's all white. It's perfect. There's like a little how to care for it, how to use it, um, a little paper in there right now. But 
Oh my gosh, I was so obsessed with this. So thank you so much, girl, honestly, for sending this to me. This was amazing. I was like, yes, I have to get that. So again, Mello, thank you so much, girl. If you're watching, I really, really, really appreciate you sending me this um, because I honestly would have never have known. Not all of my targets had it. Like I said, I had to go a little distance to find it. Um, and the one that I did find it out, they didn't have it sitting out on the floor. It was in the back. So um, I will probably try and leave as much information about this down below as possible since they might still have them. Um, so yeah. There's that. <laughs> um, and my box also didn't even have like a clearance sticker or anything like on it, like that on it. Um, I think the picture that she sent me of the one that she found had a clearance sticker on it. Mine did not, but it did ring up half price. Yeah. No clearance sticker on my box. So, um, anyway, yeah, I will try and leave as much information about the Dutch oven down below as possible. And, uh, hopefully they are still out there. Anyway, yes, there's that. Uh, that is all of my kitchen stuff. Holy moly. We made it through. Okay. Let's keep going. This is going to be a long video. I can already tell because I've been doing a lot of talking and we've got a lot more stuff left to get through. So these next two items, I thought they would look really, really cute with my decor. I found these at TJ Maxx. They were only $4.99 and they're from the brand Sheffield Home. I have some other things from that brand as well, but this is just what they look like. They're these really cute decorative hooks and I just love this kind of French style that they have. They're all white. They're not really distressed or anything like that. They're just a solid white kind of ornate Victorian French design with these really fun double hooks on them. These would be great in a bathroom near your front door for coats, keys, things like that, whatever you want. Um, again, bathroom, you could put towels, robes, things like that. They are a good size and they were only five bucks for $4.99. So I really, really like them. Again, I only found two. And I do have kind of a gold shelf, very similar to like the actual like shape of the hook thing itself, like itself, like this shape. I have something very similar to this that I'm going to be putting in like an entryway. I don't even think I've ever even showed you guys that on camera before. But anyway, um, I thought these would be cute. If I did want to put these on either side of that, that would be cute there or again, a bathroom, it would work. So yeah, so many different possibilities. You could put this in your garage as well. If you want to hang things up in your garage um, and you want like a glamorous garage or a girly garage, that's probably going to be me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I love these. I thought these were really, really fun. And again, from TJ Maxx for only four bucks or uh, four ninety nine. my bad. So yes, love these. So cute. Could not pass them up. So next we're going to be talking about a few more unicorn type items. And just like that mug I was talking about a little earlier on, I did pick up a matching piece to go with it. This is just what it looks like. It's this really fun, cute trinket tray with the exact same unicorn face, same little gold horn up at the top. Again, I found this at TJ Maxx. It was only $3.99. I don't know the actual brand on this, but I decided to pick this up because I did get a new job. So I will have a new cubicle to decorate. I'm kind of going all new, everything fresh. It's a new start, new beginning. So I picked this up for my office. And I just thought it was really, really cute. Um, yeah, if you guys follow me on social media or if you watched, it was one of my Christmas videos that I talked about getting a new job. It was like a new thing, a new start, all that good stuff. So I just thought this would be really cute to put paper clips on or like binder clips or tacks, things like that, things I'm going to need. Um, and I also picked up something else for my new office that I showed in my Christmas clearance video because it was a part of like the gift stuff and it was on clearance. Um, I found this at Marshall's and it was marked down to $10, a yellow tag. So this is just what that looks like. It's a really cute little gold box with this really fun little gold metal bow right here. And again, it has like a glass lid. And I just thought this would be really cute to set post-it notes in and other kind of like desk type stuff, pens, pencils, things like that. I still wanted to share this with you anyway, because again, it's also decor and I did pick this up for my new office. So yes, that is that item. And I do have another item that I believe I'm going to take to my office as well. That's also along the lines of unicorn. Um, I found this at Home Goods for $7.99 and this is just what it looks like. Really, really cute. It's just a tiny, solid baby pastel pink unicorn ceramic head, and it is a coin bank, as you can see right there, and I just thought this was really cute. It's so small, so tiny. It's not huge or anything like that, so anyway, I thought this would be really fun kind of in my new cubicle. Um, my old cubicle I've had literally since 2010, since I was really, really young, so um, I was 18 when I got the job, so I really haven't updated the decor or the pictures in there for literally almost eight years, so um, yeah, Yes, it is time to kind of spruce it up a little bit, make it a little bit more fun and kind of add some really fun touches to my new cubicle as well. So I'm really excited for my new job. I'm really excited for like my next little step in my life and to start this new year off with a new job. So anyway, I'm excited. I am going to be buying a lot more office decor and things like that once I kind of figure out the size, things like that, all that good stuff. Um, and then we'll go from there as far as like some more office decorating um, hall type videos, I guess. Things like that, cubicle decor, whatever. Um, but yes, 
Okay, one more unicorn type item and then we'll move on from there. So my last little unicorn type item, I did find this at Home Goods in the kids section and I paid $9.99 for this. Again, it's also coin bank. That's why it was in the kids section, but this is just what it looks like. It's like a larger scale version of this little guy, but this one also has a gold horn and his mouth is closed. The little tiny one, the mouth was open, but I do have one very similar to this, all white with a gold unicorn horn. Um, and I've had that in the back of my videos and it's in my office right now. But anyway, <laughs> um, I decided to pick up this light baby pink one just to kind of mix in there, here and there. I'll probably add it in my room um, after I take down Christmas and I'll kind of mix in with Valentine's Day, things like that. I just thought it was so sweet, so cute and adorable. And it's from the brand Barry Winkle. I know I've picked up frames from this brand before. And again, they just call it a unicorn uh, coin bank. <laughs> so yes, I thought that was so fun. Again, it was only 10 bucks. They have a bunch of different colors like this. So anyway, yes. Okay, that is my last and final unicorn for this video. How many unicorns is that? Like four? Four unicorns? That's a lot of unicorns for one video. So okay, anyway, woo! Moving right along, let's keep going. So this first book, I was so excited to find this at Charming Charlie. It was $19.99. I've been wanting this book for a while and I've never really like looked for it at like bookstores and things like that, but I was at Charming Charlie and I found it. I was like, oh my gosh, I've been wanting this book for so long. Anyway, it's called Bad Girls Throughout History. And I just thought this was really awesome. It says 100 Remarkable Women Who Changed the World by Anne Shen. So I thought this was beautiful. I love all of these images and illustrations. Just such a beautiful book. This is what the binding looks like if you are curious. Again, I have had this in pictures and things like that on my Instagram and Twitter. Um, but yeah, I was so excited to find this. I know 20 bucks, it is what it is, but it was just such a beautiful book. And again, I've been wanting it for a while. I've been meaning to look for it on Amazon and like at Barnes and Noble and things like that. Oh, there was Jane Austen. Amelia Earhart, look at that. Oh, that's just so awesome. So I'm really excited to actually like go through this book, flip through it a little bit more. Again, I have flipped through it, but um, I feel like you see new ones all the time. Oh my gosh, Mary Blair. Okay, so Mary Blair, yes, brought Disney flair, brought Disney new flair. She does, is a designer and she did a bunch of stuff for Disney. Um, like it's a small world and things like that. There were some fun designs. I think she even did some of the Tiki Room as well. But yeah, anyway, I was just so excited to kind of actually flip through that and see her name. Um, yeah, anyway, that's awesome. One of the most influential artists in Walt Disney Animation Studios history, Mary Blair and her unparalleled color and design skills have continued to inspire generations that followed. So, oh my gosh, I, I love this. This is so awesome. She went on to create the defining looks of Disney's most iconic career, uh, films such as Cinderella, Alice in Wonderland, and Peter Pan. Oh my God, I love that I like just turned to that page. That's so awesome. So, uh, so many different, oh my gosh, Lucille Ball, literally queen. Look at her. Oh, I just love this. Oh my gosh, Rosa Parks. Yes, look at that picture too. Oh, so beautiful. So this is awesome. Also, I'm filming this on the day of the Women's March, which is actually really like, I guess, ironic <laughs> uh, that I would be talking about this the same day that all of the Women's Marches are going on. That is just so awesome. So many big names in this book. Maya Angelou. Um, oh my gosh, here are some more. I don't recognize some of these women, but oh, Diana Nyad. She was that one that did that swim, that really long swim from Cuba to Florida. Oh uh, yeah. Never, ever stop swimming. So many amazing things. Oh my gosh. Oprah, literally Oprah. <laughs> so awesome. Tina Fey. Oh my gosh. I'm even more obsessed with this book than I was before. I didn't see a bunch of these the first time I flipped through this. This is awesome. Oh my gosh. You guys, if you love everything about women and empowerment and just women who've like been trailblazers throughout history, this would be a perfect, perfect gift for somebody or even for yourself. Um, just so many amazing stories and they're all just like one page stories about each person. Oh my gosh, Susan B. Anthony. So yeah, they're just like one little page of write-ups and these beautiful illustrations. Um, and again, there are a hundred remarkable women in this one. Harriet Tubman, just so beautiful. This would be an amazing gift for somebody. So I'm actually really excited about this. There are some that I didn't even see the first time I flipped through this. So, oh yes, so beautiful. I just love this so much. Okay, that is that book. Enough babbling, let's keep going. So this next book that I picked up, I've never heard of this. I've never seen it before, but I found this at Home Goods, and I just thought there was something really different about it. I don't have a bunch of like cookbooks or baking books, things like that. And I just thought this was so pretty. I know, I know they say don't judge a book by its cover, but I definitely did because this is so beautiful. So I paid at $19.99 for this at Home Goods, and this is just what it looks like. It's from Rosie Dakin, and it's called Butter Celebrates. 
treats, delicious recipes for special occasions. So I thought this cover was just so beautiful with the light pastel colors. And then of course, the like metallic gold detailing. And then even the binding was just really, really pretty. It just says butter on the side. Butter celebrates and then again, her like the author name right here. So I love it. I just thought it was pretty. This paper cover is not in the best of shape, but it's really not terrible. There's no tears or anything. Just like a couple like little kind of it's kind of rolled up a little bit or kind of I don't even know just kind of curling up I guess that's a better word um but then the book outside of the paper is actually pretty it's not the exact same but it is still really really pretty so this is just what the book looks like without the cover it's like a whole different cover to the book and then here is the side very similar but it doesn't have the gold border that the paper uh cover has so still really really beautiful nonetheless and there are so many yummy looking recipes in here and this is just what the opening cover looks like so beautiful such a pretty blue kind of tiffany blue floral print um, let me see if I can find one that I saw the other day that I thought looked really yummy. So there was just something about this book that definitely caught my eye. It looks a lot different than most cookbooks that I have seen around home goods lately um, and all that good stuff. But yeah, there's just so many yummy looking treats in here. Ooh, sweet potato. What? Girl, I love sweet potatoes. <laughs> uh, sweet potato chews. Is that for a dog? Or is that for me? Oh no, that's for a dog. Whoops. <laughs> So there's a little dog section. Here is like a Halloween section. So it must go by like holidays. I didn't even catch on to that one. Ooh, a little ghost of meringues. So yeah, ooh, stuck in my hair. Ooh, okay. <laughs> that was extra dramatic, but look at how cute. So again, so it's just basically like different. Oh, Thanksgiving. Okay, here we go. <laughs> This must just be a bunch of different holidays in here. I didn't even catch on to that the other day. That is so funny. Oh, Christmas. Oh, so cute. Let me see what Christmas one's in here before I finish talking about this. Chocolate gingerbread something. I don't know how to pronounce that word. I'm just going to make myself look like a fool if I try to. Holiday gems. Cranberry pistachio icebox cookies. That looked interesting. Snowballs. Uh, fruit cake. Eggnog list bars. That's funny. Orange gingerbread cake. Butter Salted Caramels. Ooh, heck yes. Oh my gosh, so many yummy things. Again, called Butter Celebrates. So, so adorable. Okay, that is my last book. Moving on to some more decor. So this next item, I have had this for a couple months and I actually have one back there. You could not see it because the little calendar is blocking it, which actually I do need to find a new calendar. That is 2017. I need to find a new one. We are in January, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I have yet to actually see them. So that's kind of a bummer. But basically I found these two really awesome pots from TJ Maxx. They were each $6.99, which I thought was an amazing deal for these so basically this is just what it looks like it is just a pot to put plants in things like that but I do have my like little gumdrop stick in there but here is what the other one looks like and I had both of these in my pink mantle Christmas decorate with me video so I love these I think these are really really awesome they're so beautiful they're like a really pretty shade of pastel pink and then they kind of have like this cement gray kind of color down here which I just thought was really awesome and this does say suitable for outdoor use so you don't have to put a fake plant in this at all but $6.99 that is an amazing deal. It doesn't give a brand on this at all, but I just thought this would be so fun to put a topiary in or something like that. I love being able to put the little gumdrops in there and things like that, but I also use this for some like, um, like little styrofoam pumpkins that I had on my dresser hutch type thing during um, Halloween. Yes, <laughs> during Halloween. I was going to say fall, but I think it was just out for Halloween. Um, but I did post that on my Instagram, I believe. Yeah, Instagram and Twitter. So anyway, I love this. I thought this was great. Again, I have had this for a couple months, but I just thought these were really awesome. For $6.99, I still wanted to share these with you because I do plan on using these in my office. Um, and yeah, I was so excited to find these. I'll probably insert a picture here just because the coloring right now is kind of looking a little dingy but the picture will definitely show the coloring more um, true to what it actually looks like than on my camera right now. So anyway, yes. Okay, that is my pot. I do have two of them. The other one is back there. Again, $6.99 from TJ Maxx. Such a good deal. So this next item, I actually picked it up the same day that I picked up these two cute little pots. But basically, I found this at TJ Maxx on super duper clearance. I, th I think that just sounded like TJ Maxx. But I found this at TJ Maxx and it was originally $19.99 and it looks like there are three four clearance yeah three clearance stickers and then my clearance sticker so I don't know what all of the other ones say but basically I paid five dollars for this it was originally 20 bucks and I did post this uh with like a cute little fall candle and pumpkin and whatnot during the fall time but basically it's just like this marble slab 
a little tray with handles in gold and then the edges are all gold as well. So I thought this was great. Again, only $5. I think that I'm going to put this in my bathroom, kind of vamp it up a little bit, clean up the counter a little bit, kind of organize it a little bit. <laughs> and I just thought this was so great for only $5. Such a good deal. So again, yeah, originally 20 bucks and then there's two red tags and then two yellow tags on top of it. So I was so excited to find this. Really, really cute. My sister found one as well, also for $5, but I just thought this was so cute. It is very heavy. <laughs> I will say that, but I was glad I found it. You could really use this in your kitchen, bedroom, wherever you want, but I think that I'm going to put this in my bathroom. You can also put this in your office with like office supplies. I think that's what Kaylin was uh, planning on doing with hers. She hasn't used hers quite yet, but anyway, yeah, I love it. I think it's really fun. And again, really, really affordable for only $5. So this next item, I was really, really, really excited to find, and it actually kind of has a little funny story to go along with it but basically I found this at Marshall's it was only $7.99 and it's from the brand Mercury and they just call this the magnet micro LED light box but this is just what it looks like it comes in this little mini box and it is just a mini pink light box I picked up a second one for my giveaway that I'm going to be doing uh fairly soon I guess it's at the bottom that I opened it um so I did pick up two of these because it was just such a good price this is just what the little mini one looks like so I was really excited to find this even though I didn't get the full size one but basically the whole backside and all of these sides are that really fun baby pastel blush pink color. I feel like in the viewfinder you can't see the pink color that well. Again, maybe I'll insert a picture or something, but I just love this. I thought this was so great. And then all of the letters that come with it look like this. They all are pink letters. So again, I have used them. So that's why some of them are kind of broken off by now. But yeah, there are how many letters? So there are 72 pink letters and symbols included cool white light LED backlight, magnetize to your locker, fridge, and more, easily hangs on a wall or stands on your desk, battery or USB powered for AAA batteries or the USB cable. So basically you would just plug this up to like the little brick that goes to your phone charger or whatever. You also plug this into your computer, anything like that. So I thought it was great. It does just plug in right here and it can turn on or again, you could put batteries in it as well. So I thought this was great. Really, really fun. I love the size of this. It is a very fun, compact size. And I had a lot of fun actually like working with it and putting together like my little New Year's Eve picture just because I thought it was so cute. So um, that's upside down. <laughs> but basically keep your eyes out for that giveaway video because there will be another one just like it, literally the exact same um, in that giveaway video. So I was excited to find two of them. It was like meant to be one for me, one for the giveaway, moving right along. So these next two items, I really wasn't looking for anything like this, but I really, really love these and I love the design. Target literally sold something very similar to this, but it had succulents in it. I'm not really a succulent kind of gal when it comes to my decorating. So when I found these empty, I was so excited. I found them at Marshall's for only $9.99. This is just what they look like. They're those really fun like little potter plant type things, but then on this really fun gold metallic wire base like stand. I just thought this was so awesome. It was such a good size and price for only 10 bucks. I feel like the lighting is really making this look a lot darker than it actually is. But I thought this was great. Such a good deal for only $9.99. And this is ceramic. This is metal. They are quite heavy. So I keep saying they because I picked up two of them. So I think that I'm going to figure out a spot for these in my office. But I love them. I'm so excited. If I can't find a spot for both of them in my office at my house, I will take one to my new cubicle and do something with it there. But I thought this was just so beautiful. I love it. I'm obsessed. I could not get enough of these. They had a bunch of them at my Marshalls and yeah, such a good price, only 10 bucks. I think the ones from Target, of course, were like more like $20 or 25, but again, they also had succulents in them. I know that there's a lot of people that like succulents and things like that, but I just like flowers. So I'm just going to try and figure out something to put in them with flowers, things like that. Okay. Lauren, stop talking. Keep going. <laughs> so this next item, I actually picked up two of them from TJ Maxx in November, but I still wanted to share them with you anyway. So again, like I said, I found these at TJ Maxx. They were each $5.99 and they're these really beautiful frames. So I, oopsie, ow. <laughs> I used this in a Christmas DIY craft video that I did. It was like a collaboration with this company called Print and you could print off pictures. Um, this one actually is a still from a video. So when you run your like app over it. It plays the video. It's like the coolest thing. If you want to see that video, I will have it linked down below, but I still wanted to share these frames with you anyway, just because I really am obsessed with them. I picked up two. This is just one of them. And I see like the little papers that came inside and it's from the brand Parisian home frame collection, five by seven inch frame matted into a four by six. So yeah, that's what the little papers look like, but it's just this really beautiful frame. Let me take this out so you guys can see, um, better. Oopsie. Oh, okay. 
So yes, it's just a very simple gold trimmed frame. It is metal. I just thought this was so beautiful. It comes with this white mat. So again, the frame size five by seven, but then with this white mat in there, it makes the picture four by six. So you could take the mat out. You don't have to keep it in there, but I picked up two of them. I thought they were so beautiful. Once I like decide to kind of switch this out or whatever, um, I don't really know where I'm going to kind of, kind of put it quite yet, but I was thinking either my office here or at my new cubicle. That was kind of something that came to my mind recently. So, um, yeah, because I was thinking when I was taking down all of the pictures in my old cubicle, I was like, I want new picture frames and I really, really loved these. And so I was like, oh, I want to find something similar. And I was like, why not just change out the picture, take something else to my new office um, in these beautiful frames? Since they were only $5.99, that was such a good deal. So I'm obsessed. I love them. I think they're great. Okay, I'm literally losing my voice because I've been doing so much talking. This is probably going to be the biggest video, I swear. So these next two items I'm so excited for. Basically, I've had one for a little bit and then I found a second one very recently. They are these really awesome. Some Kate Spade blankets. They just call these fleece throws. They are from Home Goods. They were only $16.99. So this technically was the first one that I picked up to put with like my regular home decor and things like that. It's just such a pretty shade of pink. I love it so much. Again, $16.99 is such an amazing deal. I picked up a second one for my sister for Christmas. It was so funny. I had already bought her one and then we were at Home Goods and she found like the huge full like bed size one and she was like, oh my gosh, I don't know if I should get it. And I was like, it's like, no, no, you don't need it. You're fine. Knowing full well that I got her this one for Christmas. So when she opened it, she was like, oh my gosh, I was wondering, trying to figure out why you told me not to buy that one. So it was like meant to be so, so gosh darn perfect. So basically, like I said, I have had this one for a couple months now, but when I was thinking about my new cubicle and things like that, I decided I wanted one or I wanted a blanket for my cubicle. And I just kind of take random little blankets here and there, things with like prints and images on it. And I thought, you know what, it'd probably be good just to keep like a nice solid color blanket in my cubicle. And I wouldn't have to tote them back and forth and things like that. So that's why I decided to buy one strictly for my new cubicle and whatnot. And also this cubicle, I'm sure will be larger than my last one because my last one was very, very small. So I'll have some more storage space and things like that to put things there. And also if I have like an accent chair in my cubicle, I'm, I don't even know what size my cubicle is going to be. But in the case that it is a good size one, I do have like an extra chair in there. This would be really cute sort of laying over that and kind of give it a nice little homey touch. So again, $16.99, you cannot pass it up. It's a beautiful color. It's a great brand, great price all of the above. So yes, technically I have purchased three of them. One for like my actual home decor, one for my new cubicle. Yeah, again, I don't know if I've mentioned this, but I technically could have taken this one to my office, but I would have been heartbroken if something happened to it and I didn't have another one as like a backup. So I'm just going to stick with this one in my actual home decor. And again, just keep the, this one strictly for my new work and office and things like that. So anyway, yes, that is that. Those are my two new blankets. I do have two more items left for this video. That was feeling like a little juggling act <laughs> from blanket to blanket. But love these. So great. Great quality. And again, I know that Home Goods has had these in other colors like white. I've seen navy. I've seen gray. Of course, maybe pink. I think I've seen hot pink. Um, there's been so many different colors, so many different sizes, so many different prices, things like that. But they've all been somewhat affordable. Not somewhat, but like some of them were like $40 and up. So, um, but yeah, to me, $16.99 is a really, really good price. So again, love it. Keep your eyes out. So many different colors, so many different styles and sizes and prices and all of the above. So, okay. Woo! Those are my two new blankets. Again, I do have two more items. They are right here. We're gonna move into those and then this video will be over. So this next item actually does kind of have like a funny little story and you will see something a little similar to this in a separate video coming up very, very soon. But basically I picked up this beautiful pillow that says LA with all of these really fun palm trees. And of course, if you guys have been around for a while, you guys know that I'm planning a move to LA. I really wanna buy a house down there, a fixer upper, all that good stuff. So it's been quite the process and I am not just moving down there for the heck of it. Moving down there because I want to pursue my acting career and all that stuff, which I am currently training for now. I feel like I have to like say that because a lot of people are like, oh, you just want to move to LA for the heck of it. I'm like, no, <laughs> I'm moving down there to start my life and career. Okay. Anyway, so I picked up this pillow to put in my office here at my house um, and things like that. And I found it at Home Goods for only $19.99. I'm so obsessed with this. It's kind of like a creamy color. It's an interesting kind of fabric, as you can see there. But I thought the like idea of the palm trees going all the way around it was just so fun. I thought this was great. My plan with this, again, was to put this on my director's chair in our office here at my house and you will see something very similar to this in an upcoming video so I'll probably actually just tell the story in that video because when I first saw this I had my heart set on this no one could talk me out of it I was so excited to find this I cannot wait to actually now display this in my office now that I have officially hauled it um but yeah again 1999 I don't know the actual brand of this because it doesn't say it's just like the little like a 
safety tags and washing tags. There's not like another uh, brand tag or anything like that. So love it. Okay, we've got one more item and then this video will officially be over. Okay guys, so my last and final item for this video, I'm so excited for it and I'll probably end up having to insert some sort of photo or video footage of it because it's so big. But basically if you guys watched my what I got for Christmas video last year for Christmas, my parents surprised me with this amazing table that I had really, really wanted from Target. It was beautiful. It was pink, scallopy, all of that good stuff. But recently I found the matching Tiffany blue table on sale at Target. So it was originally $79.99. I got it on sale for $39.98. I'm so excited for this table, literally half price. It's so beautiful. So this is just what the bottom looks like. Again, I'll probably have to insert some sort of footage or whatever, just because I really don't have the space to show you this table, but it is all metal. It's so perfect. If you guys follow me again on like Twitter or Instagram, I posted a picture of all of my Tiffany blue Christmas decor that I had set up on this table, which looked so perfect and so amazing. Amazing. So you will have seen a part of this table in that picture because I made sure to show the beautiful scallops that I'm so obsessed with. So anyway, I was so excited to find this. I feel like they were just clearancing out a bunch of furniture and things like that to bring in all of the new lines of stuff that they're carrying, things like that. You know, Target has been getting crazy with all of their new decor. So that was kind of my like thought <laughs> as far as like why they were clearancing it, but that's okay. I will definitely gladly take this clearance beautiful Tiffany blue table, even if it is meant for a kid, doesn't matter. There are so many different options you could do with that table. Um, you could literally put that in a bathroom. If you have extra space, put bath bombs and like hand towels, extra soaps, things like that. A kid's room would also be great for like a little reading table. You could put it in a living room, dining room, on your patio, outside. There are so many different options with that table. And again, I'm excited to eventually decorate with it because right now I don't really have to pick where it's going to go because I don't really know what room it's going to work its way into quite yet. But I'm really excited to have both the pink and Tiffany blue. I didn't even know they made the Tiffany blue one. I just knew of the pink one last year. So when I stumbled across this, I was so excited. So basically I got it for $40 plus the Target card 5% um, cash back thing that they do. So technically 5% percent of that off as well. So I technically really didn't pay full $40 for it. So anyway, I'm obsessed. I love it. I love the fact that that's like the most expensive item in this video was $40. So um, yeah, that's all. That's all I have for this video. Holy moly. Okay, guys. So that's all I have for this video. Thank you seriously so much for watching this video. If you guys made it this far, please leave a comment that says, oh my gosh, I'm so fabulous. And um, yeah, I will greatly appreciate you for making it through this video. I know it's going to be so long just because I feel like I've been talking forever. My throat is on fire right now. It is literally burning. I have been talking for so many hours straight, but it feels so good to actually sit down and film a home decor haul video just because I've been talking about holiday stuff for the last three months. So it was great to just sit down and talk home decor and all that good stuff that I love so much. So anyway, if you guys did enjoy this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. That way you'll be notified when I post new videos. And if you guys want to follow me on any of my social media pages, I have Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. I will leave all my little handles right down here as always. And as you guys can tell, I feel like a broken record in this video talking about how many times I've posted pictures of things from this video on my social media pages. So if you guys are on there, it definitely would be beneficial, at least in my eyes. Um, and of course I post, I love posting cute little pictures and things like that. So anyway, yeah, that's all. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys seriously so much for watching. Um, I cannot wait to actually get back into like the regular swing of things, the regular videos, all that good stuff. So many things are happening. So many changes are happening. Um, so I'm going to be kind of tossing in like regular videos and things like that in the midst of like like the rest of my seasonal ones that, that I still have left to upload that I already filmed. So anyway, keep your eyes out. Thank you for hanging in there. I know this year is going to be so crazy and so full of so many exciting things. So I don't want you guys to miss it. So definitely subscribe and also turn on that little notification bell if you guys want an alert sent directly to your phone the second I post a video. So anyway, yes, there's that. Thank you guys seriously so, so much for watching. I really do truly appreciate it. And I will see you all in my next video.